All right, how many odd natural numbers are there with four digits with no repeats? Okay, so I've got four digits. Okay, so four subtasks to complete to finish this, this question. How many odd? Okay, so it's got to be an odd. So uh, that's the restriction on the last digit. How many options are there? Well, it could be one, three, five, seven, or nine. Okay, so I've got five options for what this, this digit could be. Now let's go to the first digit. Okay, well it can't be whatever this is because I'm not, I'm not allowed to repeat. But it also can't be zero. And there's no way that one of these would be zero. Okay, so that it's not like, it's not like, ah, zero's already been taken up here. No, no, zero wasn't. So it turns out there were actually two restrictions on this one. So there's eight digits that could be. Now, this second position here could be zero. So what are the restrictions on this one? Well, it can't be this, whatever I chose here, and it can't be whatever I chose here. So there's two digits it can't be. Again, there were 10 to choose from. So again, that puts us at eight. So, I, okay, we gotta go back to this one just to discuss what's going on here. Remember, I chose a digit to go at the back there, at one of the odd digits. I can't use that again here, but I also can't use zero. That means there are two digits I can't use here out of the 10 possible. So that gives me eight options. Here, I could use zero. The only thing, the things that I can't use here are whatever I chose for the first digit, whatever I chose back here. Again, that's two options that I can't use out of the 10, eight options. Now here, okay, for this one right here, uh, it turns out there are seven options because there are three that have been removed from my, my list that I can choose from. And so that's how you fill that one out here. And when you multiply that all out, you'll get 2,240.